Welcome to Paul's Toolbox. Today I'm going to cover taking out the fascia and soffit and replacing it. And I have drip edge on here, so we'll have to tackle that too. No big deal. Another big problem that we have, or another problem that we have, is azaleas right here. Tall bushes. It, it keeps me from getting in that corner. So I made a little frame right here. Nothing to it, just a frame that I have that I can set right up on the corner so I can get to this and work on it. I have a little platform on there where I can sit if I need to or stand and put my tools on it. And it's gonna really help me out without uh, damaging my azaleas. I can take that frame apart and I'll use the lumber for something else after. You can see right here we have some pretty good damage. The wood's rotted. Like I said, water was running down this and came through the backside and all of this is rotted out. So we're gonna just pull it out and replace it. Not a whole lot to it. I am gonna to have to work around a light right here. So I'm gonna disconnect the power and take this loose so I can pull it down because we're gonna to have to replace this wood right here. I'm gonna take this light out. It's disconnected. And I'm just gonna unscrew the mounting screws and take it off. See these two wires, this black one is your hot, and this white one is your neutral. It's disconnected already, the power's off, so I'm just gonna take them loose. And you'll have, on your wiring, your two hot leads go to the one side, and your two neutrals go to the other side, and you can see there's one lead and one neutral for each one of the uh, lights. I took the box out, I recapped the wires, and I just tucked them back in there. Now I can take my saw, mark a line right here, and cut it right across. I'm going to take my Swanson Speed Square, set it right up against this trim piece, and I'll get a straight line. Now I can take a straight edge and continue it on. When you get to this edge right here, you have a two by, a two by eight usually across the face of this. And it's nailed to that uh, plywood, so you want to go on an angle, get as much of it as you can without cutting this fascia. So we'll just chisel that other little part out, no big deal. Now that this is loose, this part right here I need to take out a little bit, and I've got nails back there. This is a demo blade, so get this in here. Okay. We're loose from here, and everything's loose except for this face part. We don't want to pull this down and crack that fascia. So we're going to take this part right here and get it loose. I'm going to have to cut it. Since this is one solid piece, I'm going to take it with the saw and go right to here, and we'll be able to pull that little piece out of there. Take this, wiggle it down a little bit, be real careful, it comes right out. See how it's rotted? What we're going to do now is cut this straight across here. I'm going to take a block of wood on the top and put across so I'll have something to tack this to and that to. I'm going to tack that onto the, the back, just a piece of wood, and it'll strengthen this up. So I'm going to cut this straight across right here. two by four that runs across here so that's a little part that I'm gonna to have to break loose and chisel out. Well, got real lucky, it broke off basically clean. All I have to do is chisel a tiny piece off of it. Just gonna take my hammer, chisel. It's 
clean that up. I don't have much daylight left, so what I'm going to do is just put a piece of plastic across here so nothing gets in it, and uh, I'll resume this tomorrow.